Hello, today I'm here with Hendrik von Kantrex to introduce the new CAN display for BMW. Yeah, hi, this is Hendrik uh, from Kantrex. I'm here with Alex from Alpha N, and we're here to introduce you to the uh, data display for the BMW F series, which we have uh, lately um, developed. Um, to the company of Kantrex, we are a German vendor with German production and German development, and uh, we are originally from the uh, Volkswagen Audi displays which we have um, also developed and we had uh, great success with these models in the market as well and Alex approached us to do something similar for the BMW series so what we uh, actually did first we we developed something for the BMW E30 and uh, E46 series which are working mostly with uh, standalone ECUs but together with these uh, E series and F series we have a lot of great possibilities to get the data from the original ECU from the canvas uh, that's what we have uh, developed together. So the uh, production of Contract um, of our displays takes place in, in Germany as well as the development. We put a lot of effort into our products to, to have a nice integration into the cars. That's what you will see later in the pictures. Uh, we, did, we did a nice integration into the vent, so you can actually also use the vent. And um, we put some nice uh, features into the software which will help you uh, to, to use the display even more um, on your daily use. Um, but we will show you that later in the video. Okay, here's our uh, data display, what we uh, have installed in Alex uh, M2 competition. Uh, we have a really clean setup of the screen, so we can see our boost, our intake temperature, our oil temperature, our, our water temperature, and our uh, lambda or AFR value. And here's the um, RPM data. The display really reacts uh, really quick to, to, to the data. There's no delay uh, when displaying the stuff. We have different screens, so you can set up everything as you like. Uh, we have different widgets, everything can be um, resized, you can change the position, you can change the sensor, which you want to see in, in the widget. Right here we have the uh, EGT, exhaust gas temperature, our um, boost, that's the, that's the map value, oil temperature, water temperature. Um, we have a performance meter inbuilt, so this is the 0 to 100 times and uh, 100 to 200 times, and you always see your your best mark uh, when you did your pull. And you can set up everything individually. We have a little uh, USB plug hidden uh, where you can attach your laptop and then you can set up everything as you need. We have integrated a capacitive um, touch screen, uh, which means which is uh, really sensitive to your, to your finger touch, not like the resistive ones, just like your, your cell phone. And we use this to switch the pages and we can um, set up the, the exhaust flap. When you start the car and the display, it's set to auto, so just like stock. And you can change it to be permanently open or permanently closed. And then can, you can set it back to auto. So really nice feature. What we also did together with Alpha N, we integrated their, their additional box, which you can hook up to your ECU, the Alphatronic. So what you can do, you, can, you have three maps, which you can switch right with a tab on the display and you can see data from the, from the box, which is the boost. You can see your lambda, and you have two channels in addition, which you get from the box via the canvas, so you can tr control your add-on box through the display. You can set up the uh, sensors within the display with your own minimum and maximum values, uh, so you, that you can have individual warnings. Just like the oil temperature over here, you can uh, set up the widget so it turns red when the, value, the maximum value got exceeded, and it turns blue when the minimum value is crossed as well so you can see whether you need to go slower when your temperature is too high or when the temperature is too low and you need to warm up the car this has also been shown within the widget the display has got a internal uh, logging feature uh, we have set up this screen together with the logging button and you can start uh, your logging by just uh, a tap on the lock button and it continuously logs data onto the uh, internal sd card which you can later pull via the uh, usb cable to your laptop so you can have a round on the racetrack and later on you can double check your data if your lambda values, AFR, your boost values, everything is fine during the drive so you don't have to have an eye on the display all the time and later you can stop the logging and when you're finished you just plug your laptop to the USB to get the data. Um, in Alex car we put the uh, USB, we, we have hidden the USB cable um, and if you use it just pull it out, you can connect it to the laptop or to your Mac and uh, we have got our display setup software uh, where you can uh, connect to the display. You load in the uh, sensor data. So you've got all your sensors 
if you like, you can rename them. You can change the minimum and maximum values and you can uh, set up your widgets. So this is exactly the screen um, from the car. If you move the widgets, you can see the widgets moving in your car at display as well. You can change the uh, sensor you would like to see. So right now we have intake temperature. We can change this to oil pressure. Um, you can move the widgets around. You can change the colors to your needs. Go to the next page and um, you can copy the widgets, create new widgets, change uh, the widget type. We have different types of widgets uh, like line graphs, bar graphs. Again, change the color. Everything can be set up uh, from, from your laptop. You don't need to use the, the touch screen, which can be a little bit too small. With our display setup software, you can pull the locks directly uh, from the display. With our lock viewer, you can load, load them from the display, and put them into the setup software. You can uh, select uh, the data you want to see. So everything from the display is included over here. You can zoom in and then you can review your data and double check the logs and all. You can see all the values over here. And as you slide through, you can see them changing um, on the right hand side as well.